are you ready to play What's Wrong With This Prescription? One of you guys DM me this to review, so let's go through it together. For all my HIPAA police out there, there is no patient information, so we're good here. So let's see what prescription we're supposed to be dispensing at the pharmacy today. It looks like we had an MS Cotton, which is the brand for morphine sulfate, but it looks like maybe the doctor decided to change their mind and instead prescribe Alprazolam two milligrams. And you know, maybe the doctor was just having an off day, but that is not how you spell Alprazolam. It looks like Alprazolam. It's two milligrams though, which is a high dose. So we gotta first make sure that the patient has taken it before just to prevent any side effects. And then it looks like with the dispensing, the doctor wanted to do 180, but they may have just changed their mind. So now they're gonna do 90. And now let's look at these directions. So I wanna say it says PRN anxiety, three times a day. And for my non-pharmacy or medical people, PRN actually means as needed, but it doesn't say how many tablets the patient's supposed to be taking. So we obviously need to call this doctor. What would I actually do if I was a pharmacist receiving this prescription? There are a lot of red flags with the medication changing from a pain medication to an anti-anxiety medication and the fact that Alprazolam spelled wrong. Personally, I would check to see if the patient has been on Alprazolam before. And then I'd probably call the doctor just because it's very strange for them to cross off a medication and write a brand new medication and also spell it terribly wrong. Let me know what you would do in the comments.